Ay Shalom, Shalom, Shalom. First and foremost, I'd like to give all praises to the Most High Yahweh, Bahasham Yahweh Shai, Waharuka Kwadash. Yahweh is the true name of the Most High Power of Israel, the Most High God. Yahweh Shai is the true name of His only begotten Son, the one whom the world ignorantly calls Jesus, Yeshua, Jehovah, and other names. Ruka Kwadash is the Holy Spirit that gives us the understanding of this truth. I'd like to send my double honors to the apostles and elders of Great Millstone GMS who taught me this truth, which is the 100% truth. Peace and salutations to the hopeful elect spread around the four corners of the earth, pushing this gospel in all sincerity. Shalom also to the few aquats who are sincerely seeking this truth. It's the brother Yara Yaya Shar Allah from the GMS Italy camp. And I just wanted to do this quick response on the lesson that the elder Apostle Taha put out, which is very, very edifying. You know, you should go check it out on his channel, which is on um, GMS Declaring the End. So the title of the last lesson it did, I believe, was um, Revelation and Other Topics, in which, you know, it was going, it was bringing out. Um, a lesson put out by IUIC, you know, some times back, in which they were they were they were giving a false narrative of false and wicked, you know, wicked breakdown of um of the karagma of the, the MOTB, you know, in which you know it was through the spirit yesterday I did a lesson in which I also brought that out. Because I saw that video, a brother showed me, uh, that sent that video to me and it got me really, you know, it got me really spiritually upset, upset, you know, for lack of better words, you know, I was, I was like, man, how would people sit back and, you know, matured men, grown up men with beards, you know, sit down and listen to such vomit, man, you know, and the other apostle Taha in his lesson, you know, played a part in which in that same video they were referring to us of the great millstone as zombies in which <laughs> the truth is you know is otherwise you know <laughs> they are the real zombies you know members of iuic they are the real zombies you know they sit back and you know they all listen to such vomit without questioning you know and listen to, listen to what these men are saying, which is not biblical. They don't prove anything, you know. These are the real zombies, man. GMS questions everything. The sincere members of Great Millstone are students of reality, man. We search everything out. We don't we don't just gurgitate whatever whatever is brought to our front, you know. We search things out because the Most High Yahweh Hashem Yahusha has given us that spirit, you know, to do what we do. We didn't just wake up one day and decide to be members of Great Millstone, you know. We have actually studied all different camps. For example, myself, you know, at the beginning, I was watching a few different camps. You know, I even started, you know, this journey by, um, by listening to some people. Well, I can't remember what name of their camp, you know. But my spirit wasn't just really there until the day, you know, I had a vision of the... Of the chariots woke up you know was bothered about this dream you know went on youtube and i came across the video of gms you know and this teaching was you know particular you know they were saying things that were really true you know such some things out and you know ever since then i've been with this group you know now let's check out the meaning of the word zombie you know zombie meaning Now, now, let's pick the first one. So he says, a zombie is a willless, is a willless and speechless human, as in voodoo belief and in fictional stories, held to have died and been supernaturally reanimated. 
you know that reminds me of the book of um isaiah i'm um, sorry the book of um ezekiel the dry bones you know let's see if he has other No, oh, there is a definition it's not given well a person held to resemble the so-called walking dead now let's see if we have other can this is the this is the definition I'm looking for. It says a person who is or appears to be lifeless, apathetic, or totally lacking in independence, judgment, automaton. So these people they don't judge. They just they 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 are, they are lifeless because what gives life truly is this is this truth. You know, this pure hundred percent truth gives life. You know. So these people don't question, they just gadgetate whatever is brought to them, they just look, they don't make any movement of their own self, you know. I was looking for a better can you see someone you know lacking independent judgment. That's the meaning of a zombie. And guess what? The members of IUIC, ISUPK, and many other Hebrew Israelite groups, you know, they are zombies, you know, because they sit down. And listen to some dead doctrines and they don't question nothing sparks in them to wake up and ask questions and you know and make researches and pray to the most high Yahweh Shem Shai to give them knowledge as it, is, as it is written in the book of James 1 5 you know so for for the members of RUIC to sit on the table on that day in that video in which I would advise everyone to go watch the video put out by the elder pastor um taha and there is a video of iuic you know spilling that vomit and they were all there you know listening and you had other 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 of the their elders you know spilling out of vomit on the table and the people listened without questioning you know that shows you that these people are zombies now let's get some scriptures this is the book of proverbs chapter 21 and verse 16 it says the book of proverbs 21 16 says the man that wandereth out of the way of understanding shall remain in the congregation of the dead okay now the reason why i read this is um speaking about the elder of the iuic um bishop nathaniel you know he once used to make mention of the true name of the father and a son, which the true name of the father is Yahweh, and the true name of his son is Yahweh Shai. And if I was, if I'm not mistaken, you know, someone can correct me. He was part of the camp of the elder apostle Taha, so he had access to the to the truth. But all of a sudden, you know, the devil came upon him. He probably took the bag like Judas, and decided to, you know. To deny this truth to deny the name ever since then you know he has waxed more wicked in his craft you know he started off by refusing to call on the name of yahweh and his son yahweh shai then continued by you know doing all different doctrines that goes against the truth that he learned you know so who are the real zombies now let's get the book of isaiah and this same man actually went on, you know, create his own group, which is IUIC. And he has a whole lot of bunch of zombies going after him, you know, who are not asking questions. How come you used to make mention of the true names and all of a sudden you stopped? How come this? How come that? That's the definition of a zombie, man. Now, this is the book of Isaiah, chapter 1, verse 5. Which quotes, why should ye be stricken anymore? Ye will revolt more and more. The whole head is sick and the whole heart is faint. So this is 
if the head is sick because their, their elder, their leader, Bishop Nathaniel, is sick because once you once you depart from 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 the way of the truth you know you get into the congregation of the dead so is the sick head the whole body definitely is also sick this man left the truth and created his congregation which is the congregation of the dead really you know because this truth is a living water you know say out of you shall flow fountains of living water you know that's if you have the hundred percent truth then if you're not being taught the 100% truth, you're part of the congregation of the dead. And we always say this, that there are still members of the IUIC who might be part of the elect, but they really need to put their shit together, really, because time is not waiting for anybody, you know? And that's, um, that's, um, is it Elder Ayatan, you know? That's always coming on the, on the, on the comment board with different um, avatars of the, of the apostles, you know, the most high Yahweh Hashem Yahusha is going to destroy you, you know. Because you're being a part of this wickedness, you know. The wicked, they wax more and more wicked, you know. So now the question is, who are the real zombies? Who are the true zombies, you know. <laughs> if you watch the video and you listen to this man speak, a member of GMS would just stand up at that moment and leave, man. A member of GMS wouldn't listen to such... You know, fuckery, you know, permit my, my, my Italian, you know. A member of GMS wouldn't sit down and listen to such men say such abominations and bring breakdowns that they don't have, they don't, they don't even break this thing down, you know. If you listen to their teaching, you don't get the real truth. And people just keep short and, and, and just let it go like that. But in Great Millstone, it's different, man. In, the, in, in Great Millstones, the apostles starting from the other post to Taha, you know, they break things down. They give you the proof and everything. If you have questions, you ask questions, you know. We don't just gurgitate things like other camps. You have um, um, the, the general Yahana, you know, spewing all, all different madness, saying that the white man is the, is the MOTB. You have the HOI saying um, the MOTB is, um, is, is John 316, you know. They are all saying all different things except from the truth and the only the only camp that makes the best sense out of it that comes with the perfect truth is great millstone man so i'm not saying this because i'm paid or anything you know i'm saying this out of my sincerity because this is part of the job you know this is the this is the highest form of love you can you can show to or not to your to your to your neighbor who are the sons of israel you know telling them the truth if you love me feed my sheep but you feed them with the with the real real food that's going to make them grow, that is nourishing to their to their spirits, not not truth that is going to kill their spirits. You know, unlike how IUIC is doing. You know, this is wickedness. Let's get the book of Proverbs. Proverbs fourteen. Seven. This is the book of Proverbs, chapter 14, verse 7. It says, Go from the presence of a foolish man when thou perceivest not in him the leaps of knowledge. You know, this is what you should do if you're a member of any camp. You know, if you perceive that there is no knowledge coming from these elders, you should leave. This is what the Most High has taught, taught us to do. This is what a wise man would do. A great example of this is the elder post to Gabba, who was a member, if I'm not mistaken, it was a member of the ISUPK, you know. He perceived that there was no knowledge, there was no wisdom coming from this man and he left that group and he came to be a member of the Great Millstone. And you can see he has waxed, he has waxed, grown stronger in knowledge, wisdom, knowledge and understanding. When these elders speak, you can see that the Most High Yahweh Hashem Yahusha is dealing with this man. Starting from the elder apostle Taha, the, uh, the, 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 the elder apostle Aramlab, the elder apostle Raka. This man, are the, the most high Yahweh Hashem Yahusha is dealing with this man when they speak. They're sincere about everything, you know. They tell you the, the truth, they break it down to the best, you know. Now, all these other groups, they're actually looking stupid, man. It's dead zombies, man. They're looking stupid because all these things that they've they've decided to refuse that that is truth 
most especially this um, most controversial MOTB, Mark of the Beast, you know? They've said it's all different thing except from the truth, the, the microchip, which is the, the MOTB. You know, they're all looking stupid because, you know, <laughs> these prophecies are, are, are revealing, they're coming out, you know, very heavy, man. Even those that are not in the truth, that are just mere um, financial analysts, they're going to tell you that the next stage is getting the whole, the whole, the whole continent microchipped, man. Are you not saying this? So what do you have to say now? Now they're all looking stupid, man. They're not saying anything. They're just, you know, beating around the bush. We don't even see these people going out, you know, to teach these words, you know, um, in and out of season as, as we're told. You know, when it's winter, they all report back into their comfort zones. The only group that's coming out, pushing this truth. And this is where you know that the most high Yahweh Hashem Shai is dealing with the great millstone, man. Now they're all looking stupid. These prophecies are here, man. These prophecies are popping like popcorn, you know. <laughs> the MOTB is the next step, you know. Now, what are you teaching your congregation? The zombies that are dead and are not asking questions. <laughs> oh, the Most High has actually prepared a special slaughter for the house of Israel. No wonder two-thirds of the house of Israel is going to be destroyed because they are voluntarily, you know, um, departed from the truth, hence finding themselves in the congregation of the dead, you know? GMS got it right, man. GMS got it right. The MOTB is the microchip, you know? And it's the next stage. Here in, 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 in the EU, you know, they already have plans on all this. The plan is already right there, you know? All staged out, you know? It's the next step. And this demic is not a demic of, 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 of the sick or whatever. It's a demic of, 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 um, of a total new control, man. Economical control. You go look these things up and, and, and stop being a zombie, man. Now, let's get some more scriptures. So, as I said, you know, zombies don't ask questions. Zombies don't seek things out. Who are the true zombies? You know, IUIC is looking more like the zombies, man. This is the book of First Thessalonians. First Thessalonians um, chapter 5, verse 21. First Thessalonians 5.21 says, Prove all things. Hold fast that which is good. Abstain from all appearance of evil. Man, prove all things, man. IUIC, they don't prove all things. They gurgitate whatever they are God. Bishop Nathaniel, whatever it tells them, they, they take it down. They drink it down like, like sweet wine, you know? Now, do we want to go about the, 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 the Masonic... Um, um, the Masonic... Um, what's the word I'm looking for? Uh, the Masonic implications, for lack of better words, with the IUIC. Do we want to speak about the 501 C three? If we want to start speaking about IUIC, man, it's just too clear for the wise to see that, man. That's a wicked church, man. They are not for the truth. Yeah, some certain things are coming out of them. You know, they go into history about, you know, the, the so-called Negroes, Native Americans um, being um, the so-called Negroes, Native Americans being the, the true sons of Israel. And that they don't even teach to the fullest, you know. But what are we concerned about? You know, a true prophet, a true prophet is going to warn his congregation about the, the dangers ahead, you know, and that's what these people are not doing. You know, they keep their, their, their congregation asleep. They're putting out musical videos, you know, doing marriages every now and then and making this Hebrew Israelite thing look like they found the they found the they found the paradise on earth, man. Making it look like they, they found their, their, their kingdom here on earth already, in which this kingdom has nothing to do with this place, man. This kingdom needs to be destroyed, man, in order for the right kingdom to come. Yahweh Shai needs to come back, man. These people are not praying for the kingdom of Yahweh Shai to come back. 
that's why they're not teaching about the true the truth of the MOTB that it's the microchip, the potato chips, man. This is the book of First Corinthians 14 verse 29. First Corinthians 14 29 says, Let the prophets speak two or three. And let the other judge. These people don't 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 judge. It says, if anything be revealed to another that seated by, let the first hold his peace. You know, I, if you check out their video, they were all sitting on the table right there. No one is no one is questioning. No one is saying nothing. You know, these so-called elders of IUIC were just spilling all sort of wickedness. You know, wine 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 of fornication you know shooting words you know they twist the truth around you know without going to reach the point and no one questions the so-called elders and this cannot happen in in in, in great millstone in great millstone we've seen different times in which maybe a uh, 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 an elder or someone might might make an error it gets con it gets um it gets corrected immediately man People do videos and, you know, they get certain things wrong. You know, they get con they get checked immediately, you know. Such things you see only in Great Millstone. Such things you see only in Great Millstone. So who are the zombies? Who truly are the zombies? Are you, I see, you're looking more like the zombies. Let's get the book of First John. First John chapter 4, it's right at the beginning of the chapter, it says, Beloved, believe not every spirit, but try the spirits whether they are of God, because many false prophets are gone out into the world. <laughs> it says, Hereby know ye the spirit of God. Every spirit that confesses that Yahweh Shai Mashiach is come in flesh is of God. So the point is right here. Because these people, they don't confess Yahweh Shai. You know, they confess a different deity. They confess um, the, the Renaissance Jesus, you know. They say um, Israel united in Christ. Christ, that's what they call on, you know. And we know Christ comes from the Greek, you know. And if we make further researches into that, it takes you back to Christus Serapis from the Ptolemaic lineage. You see, there is no, you, you people can't stand the great millstone, man. The great millstone are men of valiance, you know. The most that Yehawba Hashem Yahushai has kept into them the spirits, you know. And nobody comes into the great millstone just, you know, coming to join vibes. They might, yeah, we know that we, are, we have some spies amongst all groups. You know, but the, the true, sincere members of Great Millstone, they are members, they are men of reality, man. You know, we wouldn't sit back there and listen to you, you know, break down Revelation 13, you know. Then you jump, you, 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 the, the Bible tells you about um, both young, great, rich, poor. Then you speak about nations, you add words that are not in there. We wouldn't listen to you say such things, man. <laughs> we would stand up and leave. Because depart from a man when thou sense that there is no knowledge in him. So who truly are the zombies? That's the question. And you, by now you should know the answer. The true zombies are the men of IUIC. So if you're, if you're there and you, you know the truth and your, your spirit is you know, telling you that Great Millstone has the truth, the 100% truth, and you're still sitting back there, you know, Guess what? You're a damn zombie and you're ready for destruction, man. Get ready for destruction because the most high Yahweh Hashem Yahusha is not playing, man. It's not playing no games. And it's not about all looking, you know, pretty in that garment, your purple garment and all that thing. You know, we get all that in the, in the kingdom. Now it's all about the walk, man. 
Now, I'll bring out one last scripture and I'll close this lesson. Now, the IUIC is looking like this. <laughs> this is what the IUIC is looking like. Let me just put the scripture down. <laughs> the IUIC is looking like this now. <laughs> this is what they look like. <laughs> I, I see this is what you look like now. This is the book of Matthew 15, 14 says, Let them alone. They be blind leaders of the blind. And if the blind lead the blind, both shall fall into the ditch. Hey, are you I see? You're looking like blind men, morphos, man. Don't let me say that word, man. Your blind leader is just leading you into a ditch, you know? Be sincere with yourself. Be sincere with yourself, man. Pray to the Most High Yahweh Shem Yahushai to give you the knowledge, the spirit of understanding, you know, to understand and see beyond all that beautiful garments, the music videos, and, 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 the, and, the, and the pretty editing of your videos and all that stuff, man. And, and, the, and, the, and, the, and the golden shofar, you know, the, the golden menorah and all that stuff, you know. The Most High, pray to the Most High to open your eyes to see beyond all that because right now, you're looking like this. Matthew 15, 14, that's what you're looking like, you know? So who are the real zombies? Now you should get the answer. The real zombies are the members of IUIC, you know? And it's not only IUIC, you know, this goes to ISUPK, HOI, and all those people, you know, teaching all that dead dead um doctrines man you know so hopefully this lesson was edifying you know i'd like to give all praises to the most high yahawa bahasham yahawashai waharuka kodash shalom